So YouTuber Dies in Every Film Customs has inspired me to take up a little bit of knife making. Um, I don't know if you remember this bushcraft neck knife he made me out of a motorcycle disc brake, but it's totally badass. As a first step, I'm going to try to make just a simple letter opener. And I'm going to use the steel out of this prison shank for the letter opener blade. Make the handle out of this cedar plank. So I just need to take the old handle off. The overall length of the letter opener is going to be 25 centimeters. I want the tip to be totally symmetrical and pointy, a pattern out of this piece of paper. And when I unfold this, it should be a nice symmetrical point transfer the shape of the pattern onto the steel. I'm going to use this 50 gram open coat diamond paper to cut the proper profile that I've traced out with my template. It's badass. The blade is going to be about half the overall length of the letter opener. So because I want to clean it up and take off the blood and the rust and stuff, I really only need to do it where it's exposed because the rest of this is going to be covered by the handle. But I can feel that this is bent, so I'm going to have to hammer this flat. Now I just need to sharpen the blade. So I've notched both edges, so I'll sharpen from here to the point on each side. So with my sharpening stone, I'm going to do one side at a time. So that's looking pretty badass. I just need to polish this up and then start working on making the handle. I was just going to trace this out and cut out a piece of wood for each side, but I think I'll do the stacked wood disc style handle like I do for motorcycle grips. To make the wood discs, I have this circle drill and I'm just going to cut a bunch of them out of this piece of cedar. So I'm going to need about 15 of these. I'm just going to stack these and then after I enlarge this hole I'll be able to slide them onto the handle. So I don't know if you can kind of see what that's going to look like. This is basically three holes and then just a little diamond paper to elongate it and it'll slip right over the handle. This is basically how it works with them all stacked up. I'll have to glue and clamp them all together and then let that set up and I'll be ready to contour and sand it. Assembly glue's had a couple hours to set up so I just need to start shaping and sanding on this. I'm using some assembly tape to protect the blade while I sand and grind on this. And now I'm using 3.2 to contour the handle. I don't know if you can see that, but it's starting to get flat on one side. I think some sealer or oil or something will really bring the detail out in the wood. So this is a water-based polyacrylic clear and it has a satin finish so I hope it turns out okay. In fact, I don't even know if this stuff's good. It's been in the cabinet for so long. It's kind of milky and bubbly so I'm going to hang it up and come back in a couple hours 
and sand it and put another coat on and just enough sanding to where all the shining stuff is gone to make sure the next coat sticks. After three coats it I think I'll just sharpen this. Ow! This letter opener turned out pretty badass for my first baby step into knife making. And it gets a solid 5 out of 5 Ichiban Moto stickers. Subscribe for future Ichiban Moto videos. It's also badass if you like them and share them with your friends.